to the reserve bench. An opportunity for Cody Taylor, Crockett, Laulala and Thrush. And just as the players go through their final warm-ups for this, Justin Marshall. So Carter starts the match. And it's Manuel Carissa, the man who played for the Stormers in South Africa this year in Super Rugby, who takes it down. And an early touch for fullback Tukalet. Put on the ground just outside the 22 is Nico Sanchez. And now halfback Cabelli with the kick. Early test here for Israel Dag at the back. Carter switching play back towards Charles Piatau, switching from right to left wing for this test tonight. And Perinara, his first touch, a rare start for him this evening. Another pass away to Carter. Ma'anonu moving it on. Nas Naholo's first touch in test rugby. The offload to Nonu. And the All Blacks set it just inside their half. Carter, Dag. And uh, while the offload wasn't bad to Sonny Bill Williams, he just couldn't get his... Hands wrapped around the ball. Changes for the All Blacks. 22 minutes of rugby ahead for Jeremy Thrush, for Wyatt Crockett and Tony for Cody Taylor. Special moment. Cody Taylor about to follow his great-great-grandfather into a New Zealand jersey. Levin produces another All Black, Cody Taylor. Product of Fielding High School, what a great moment. All Black number 1143, Cody Taylor. To try and hunt it down. And Montoya, well, it squirts out on the All Black side. So more trouble here for the corners. Why the guys? Cody Taylor goes in for what he thought was his first try. He got a call from Matachi, I think. Craig showed that Jumier was unsighted. He couldn't see, he looked, and then he decided to let it play, then he looked again, decided to let it play, and then finally he must have got it in his ear that there'd been a, a legal pilfer of the ball at the breakdown and went back to the penalty. This time Puma's ball. The All Blacks screw it this time, and McCaw has it. A great piece of destructive scrummaging there from the All Blacks. They go for the line, they're over. Taylor. It's Cody Taylor. Not to be denied this time, scoring on debut. And to think that the young man on debut was in that front row, that All Black front row, the great front row, the awesome forward pack. That's what started it, was the defence. And that is the best possible way. It even made Chalky happy. Oh, a special moment for the young man. So he followed his great, great grandfather, Walter Pringle, who played for New Zealand before they were even called the All Blacks back in the, the late 1800s. Well, all night the Pumas have had trouble clearing their own ball and look at this from the All Blacks they're going to shove them right off it out it goes to Carter Sonny Bill Williams thought about the offload held onto it wasn't held and makes more valuable metres Reed now lovely ball away to Slade who fires it into touch and you'd have to say a fitting finale for Richie McCord, Dan Carter. Final score full time New Zealand 39, Argentina 18.